graduated from Zhejiang University in Hangzhou, China. Pin firmly believed that China could benefit a lot from learning from the U.S., which led him to enroll in the Ph.D. program in economics at the University of Kentucky. On August 12, 1992, Pin Ni set foot in the United States alone with a big American dream and little savings. After two years of observing how bilateral business opportunities rise between the U.S. and China, he decided to launch Wangxiang America with twenty thousand dollars, which was all of his and his wife's savings. Twenty-five years later, Pin's company has grown from a home office to a broad business conglomerate, with its head office in Chicago and more than eighteen thousand employees, comprising automotive, manufacturing, clean energy, and diverse investments from real estate to technology. Wangxiang America now has operations in twenty-seven states across the United States, from north to south and from the east to the west. Pin is a terrific businessman. And someone who serves both his country and the United States of America very well, and at the same time he's a CEO. And I can tell you, I know of no better spokesman on behalf of the benefits of cross investment than Penn. China, the most aggressive buyer, is arguably this man, Pin Ni, and his auto parts company Wang Sheng. So you are basically a Chinese company creating. American jobs in the United States.、Uh, yeah, you can say that, but I would、uh, want to say we're an American company creating an American job in the United States too. You do have out front an American flag and a <laughs> Chinese flag. <laughs> yeah. Pin Ni's remarkable success is widely recognized. Harvard Business School teaches three Wangxiang cases in their flagship case studies. The Illinois government named August 12, 2002, the 10th anniversary of Pin's first day in America, as Wangxiang Day. Pin is dedicated to nurturing U.S.-China relationships. Wangxiang has developed many U.S.-China bridge programs. One of them is called the Wangxiang 100,000 Strong Program. Since 2011. 14 million U.S. dollars have been invested in sending 1,400 U.S. high school and college students to study Chinese language, culture, and clean energy. These students are now becoming ambassadors of a stronger U.S.-China relationship. I also want to yeah make a special、uh, thank you to Pin、uh, Ni, who、uh, has been a friend for some time、um, and、uh, who has been a、uh, Generous benefactor across Illinois and here in the city of Chicago, and someone that I think the entire business community knows. Pin Ni has dedicated 25 years to growing his business right here in the state of Illinois, and all the while prioritizing local jobs and investing in our communities. And Pin, your commitment to funding educational opportunities for young Americans to visit and to learn about China will help. Power the U.S.-China relationship for decades to come. So thank you. I'm the president of Wangxiang America. Yes, as the president of Wangxiang America, Pin is leading Wangxiang to another 25 years of glory and beyond. His American dream continues.